Fair enough. You you brought up Kanye West. Number one, what is your thoughts on Kanye? And I have an interest, and I want to go just a little bit different. I, I see, I see so many people in Hollywood and in entertainment overall. And they 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 Kanye, you couldn't get him off your news feed. This this guy dominated the headlines. And now damn near you don't even see this man. It, 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 you 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 hear about him here and there, but the, the, the Kanye news tidal wave is over. Is, is that self-imposed or is it because he's canceled? Ah, boy, you hit, <laughs> you hit me with some tough questions, man. I thought I was going to come over here. I guess I'm not Alex Thomas. I guess we, <laughs> we strayed away from the Alex Thomas path. Uh, I think that, uh, and I gotta be careful what I say, man. I think that that's a, a little bit of both. Uh, I think that's a little bit of both, but you know what Kanye, man, to me, and this is just an, a, per, a personal observation that, that, that I've made of him. And I don't know how far reaching your show is. Cause I, I most certainly don't want a confrontation with Kanye West or anybody at this time. I don't have any security. I ain't even got a gate at my thing. You want to get me, you can come right up through my front door and do something to me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, but I, you know, after the untimely death of his mother, which was a horrible thing in itself, he just doesn't seem like he's been right since then, since his, uh, since his mother passed. And who would be? I mean, that was just a horrible way she went in for, uh, and I'm paraphrasing this, some cosmetic type of surgery, and then and, and she died. So he just hasn't been the same Kanye since that happened. And I, I don't know if we, if any of us are the same, my mother-in-law just passed and my wife just had to deal with that. And, you know, she's, she's different. Uh, so I, what do you think? I mean, cause it seems like after his mother passed, it just, he just doesn't seem like he's been that, that same Kanye that we, we, we came accustomed to knowing. Um, you know, I, I, I believe in speaking truth. Um, I, 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 I was, there when Kanye first started out. Kanye wasn't on uh, the label that I worked for, but he would tell you out of his own mouth, long before he became uh, publicly known and became the superstar he became, I was out there just at, I loved Kanye West, the producer, the, the when he put out his first mixtape, I was running around working his project like he was one of my artists. So I'll start there. But I think that Kanye, like many um, public figures and celebrities, they get addicted. F f fame, the drug fame, it is more addictive than cocaine, meth, PCP, and crack all rolled up into one. And Kanye became addicted to the headlines. He became addicted to seeing himself dominate every news feed, every news cycle, every hour of the day. And he chose to push boundaries, push boundaries, push boundaries. And I'm not even sure that many of the boundaries that he pushed outside of clothing, and his love for fashion outside of music and his love for the arts. When he stepped into the world of, of politics, I'm, no, I'm not even sure how much he believed in what he was pushing in the narrative he was putting out there, but he knew it was going to get him a headline. He knew it was gonna keep him top of mind and so long as it keeps me top of mind, people are going to run and they're going to buy my Yeezys. They're going to listen to my music, all of this. But it's just so interesting that when his money, when his money got messed with, when Adidas dropped him, when all of a sudden you go from being a billionaire, now he's still richer than both of us put together. He's a multimillionaire in the hundreds of millions. 
people talk about him being crazy. If this man was really crazy, you'd still hear about him. He'd still be in the news saying crazy stuff. But he turned that PR machine off when he started to look at his financial statements and, and his uh, accountants and his handlers and all of the people who are, are, are making money off him said, hold up. Like, like, like you just stepped into something and it is going to not only cripple you, but it's going to cripple us and cripple this Kanye empire. And it's so interesting to me how if, 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 if you can't hold your tongue, if you just have to blurt things out, if you are in the news every five minutes, where's it been for the last six months after they mess with your pockets? Where's it at? So it just shows that that this 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 circus out in Hollywood it's contrived. This PR thing, when you see people in the news every five minutes, and you just think that it just happens, no, their handlers are telling them, he or she is eating at this restaurant. Get the cameras out there. They should be walking out around eleven, and they're going in with Drake. They're going in with this one. They're going in with that one. So Kanye is not as crazy as y'all think. And, Brother, and, and you, are very, you are very insightful. And see, you knew better than I in that area uh, or what have you. You know, I can't really speak to that intelligence. I'm just, I'm speaking from a fan's point of view. It just seems like after his mother passed, you know, he took on a, 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 a different uh, demeanor. And, but you hit, you hit the nail on the head because you live that world, you know, the behind the scenes. So you, you ain't like me, that, 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 that was some great, uh, Enlightenment. I, I I really appreciate hearing that. This is a very educational show, man. I mean, this is very. I, I like what you're doing here, man. You, you you sprinkle it in with comedy, but you're really educating people in a lot of ways, man. In a lot of these areas, because I gave the insight from the comedy world, and you just gave the insight from the from the music world. Very 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 insightful. What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.